Hello everybody, today I'm going to be teaching you how to get back your silver ballers the quickest and most efficient way possible. This does not require you to do the annoying gun challenge that the old man with the microphone tells you to do during the cutscene. As you can see, Mr. Microphone Man here is walking away. He's headed to his office. Basically, all you really want to do is get to his office before him, but you can't get caught doing it because if you do go in there, it's trespassing. So you want to go through this little air vent, sneak through it, and uh, he's on his way. It only takes like 30 seconds for him to get there. So if you run directly after the cutscene, you should be able to get there fast enough. And I'm going to skip forward here. But all you really want to do is just, just sit there and wait for him to get to the room. And then when he does, he's going to go to his desk. And you want to come out of cover and you want to sneak over. You want to grab him by the neck and you want to choke him to death and subdue him. You could break his neck if you want, but I felt bad for the old man, so I just knocked him out. And then there is a notebook on the floor. You want to grab the notebook and that gives you the combination to the safe. And you want to walk over to the safe. You want to open the safe with the combination that you just got from the book. And inside the safe is the keys. That's, that's all he has in the safe, is you just need to grab the key from the safe, and then you need to go back to your silver ballers. Now that you have the keys for the display case, that saves you all the trouble of going through that gun challenge. I personally have only tried it once, and then I was like, there's got to be another way. So that I searched around the level, and uh, I know a lot of tutorials say that you have to sabotage the lights and turn them off, but you don't. Because, technically, nobody out here knows that you just knocked the guy out or killed him. All they really think is that he gave you the keys to open up the case, because, in reality, there's no other way that you could have gotten the keys unless you knocked him out and took a notebook with the combination and then opened up the safe and took the keys and then snuck back out. And that's basically all there is to it. If this tutorial helped you guys out, please hit that like button. It really helps me out. And leave a comment down below letting me know if you guys want to see more tutorials like this. I have a lot more in store. So thank you. I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.